Hey guys, hope you all have been well. Welcome back to my channel. On today's video, it's just gonna be a get ready with me. I think it's been two, three weeks, so I'm due for one. I like to do these every once in a while just to sit down and talk and play with makeup and not really have like a format for the video, just kind of going for it, you know? So I'm just gonna get started. Full list of products down below as per usual. The weather is horrible. It's been this way for the past, I wanna say three days. To make up this damn mind. So today is October 8th, Friday, October 8th. This video will not be going up till Monday, October 18th. Do I want to go warm? I like to pre film, it eases my mind knowing that I don't have to film and then edit right away. And then this coming week, it's gonna be my birthday week, I'm party. I think the last like real birthday party I had, I was, it was my 23rd, 24th. Girls, remind me, I don't remember. It was that year that on every one of our birthdays, like we, we did the thing. I just remember being young and being like, I can't wait to just get older. And when you're older, you're like, mm. But yeah, my birthday is this coming Thursday, the 14th. And then my mom's birthday is on the 17th. I was her early birthday present when she gave birth to me. Yeah, her birthday is on the 17th and we have a like family celebration planned for that day. And so I know that I really need to get at least the filming done and prepped and uploaded, edited, all that stuff. I need to get it done before this coming week so that I don't I don't even have to worry about YouTube. And today, sometime today, I'm gonna get through my comments. You guys know that I don't respond to comments right away. YouTube is a very interesting thing for me. I don't do YouTube the entire day. I can't just set aside one day to YouTube. That's going to give me a headache. So I'll film and then I'll clean everything up and then I won't think of YouTube for like hours. And then maybe before I go to bed, an hour before, I'll get started on editing. I just don't straight YouTube. So I'm gonna film this morning and then later on, I'm going to work on getting through some of my comments because I haven't done my comments in a couple weeks. And it's not that I'm like, oh, comments. I love reading the comments. For me, it's more of, I don't wanna make a habit of every time I get a comment I have to stop what I'm doing and then respond to the comment you know I want to be able to do that with the time I've set aside for YouTube and so if I'm doing something with my family or running errands and I get a comment come in I don't want to stop what I'm doing for YouTube I want to have a time for it so that it doesn't impede on my regular life you know so I'm gonna respond to your comments tonight you have my word I know some of you guys don't like hearing about baseball, but uh, today was the first day of the postseason. Astros won game one. Hopefully they win tomorrow as well. And then make it to the league championship, please. I have a tab specifically just for baseball. <gasps> Razor on top, by two. It's the top of the third. Having home field advantage really, I mean, really makes a difference. The Yankees didn't make it. My dad is sad. My dad is a Yankees fan. I'm an Astros fan and my oldest brother is a Braves fan. And so two out of the three teams made the postseason this year. Sorry, dad. If you're a Yankees fan, you're probably telling me like, well, you didn't really win one because the Astros cheated. Yeah, I know. Some fans are like cool with it, but for me, it's like me. I don't really know if you can say you won a championship. Still love my Strohs though. Do you guys make the ugliest faces when you do lower lash line? I feel like that's that and mascara, the mascara face. Disgusting. Absolutely horrendous. The price you pay for beauty. This is so random, but um, we're getting golden kiwis now. They're not here year round. I don't know if like they're seasonal, but we get the shipments in every so often. And I don't really like regular kiwis. I like tart things, but I don't know why regular kiwis is just, I don't hate it, but it's not like I go out, out of my way to buy it. But the golden kiwis, yo. 
it tastes like a mango that's why i think i like it because it tastes like the local mango here they ain't cheap why water is so expensive so you guys know about about the chickens right they're always in my videos um i had to help my brother one day because he wasn't feeling well so i had to transfer them from their their pens into a different location and i didn't realize that uh, my mom had friends over i didn't realize that um one of their husbands was in the car and he's like in shock he's like you're not you're not scared I'm like no it's a it's a chicken <laughs> and these chickens are big they're heavy and there's this other time my brother's friend came to he raises chickens too and then i was helping my brother outside with the chickens and my brother's friend told him like oh i, I can help you it's no problem and then my brother went like no 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 this this one here meaning me she's professional <laughs> chickens don't scare me lizards that's a different story sometimes lizards get into the house and uh when that happens <laughs> you know i'm calling my father to say to rescue me please get rid of this thing my mom and my dad can just like grab it and then bring them outside oh my god i would die i was surprised though yesterday when i was doing the pat mcgrath video granted i i didn't talk i was just like letting youtube videos play and doing the looks but i didn't sweat at all so my brother who happens to be a teacher yes we're a family of educators around her and today's cultural day i know that in america it's columbus day that's a holiday right but here it's not columbus day it always falls on the same day but we don't call it columbus day it is um commonwealth cultural day i believe it is and so we celebrate cultures on that day that's what the holiday is for over here and if you're in school that means cultural day is the friday before so before the weekend then you have the three-day weekend and so being a product of the school system here as well as being an educator i just like remember i just remember cultural day it was always so much fun and my brother he's having his cultural day today and it's like we celebrate like the main culture, the culture of the islands, the Chamorro and Carolinian culture. But in schools, it's like all different cultures. So a, each grade level will do one country and then you would do like a performance and then you would bring dishes, you try and you know create costumes, do activities throughout the week for cultural day. And then on the last day, that's when like families come to school and then you perform your your dance or whatever it is and just celebrate. It's like it's like we do a pretty big cultural day. Cultural day is like one of those things that the school you celebrate it. Parents come in and there's like it's like a thing. But uh, at my school when I taught we did passports so we would like walk to different classes. Each grade level would be in charge of a certain country and then they'd have like this walkthrough and you could try food, you could see like they would do class projects they would wear costumes and stuff like that have music playing or videos playing and then at the end of your little tour you get your passport stamped that was really fun when i was younger we did a lot of like cultural stuff that was um like the chamorro culture and the carolinian culture which is native to the islands and it would it would be like an all-day thing you practically did not have class and i'm talking like elementary school and my elementary school was the one i taught at so it's 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 great to see like the way things have evolved but i remember as a kid and my dad used to be one of like the people that would come in and help with these activities but you were assigned to like different volunteers and you would do activities so we did um basket weavings like how to weave with the uh like coconut leaves and then we did cooking coconut candy that wasn't my favorite because you guys know how i am about coconut i don't like that but sometimes they would do empanada they would do buñuelos i know those are spanish things so those are things that like we've kind of taken from the Spanish culture and we just made our own but uh, yeah like cooking demonstrations you will learn how to make those things 
um, marmars, those flower headband type things. We would learn how to make them. And everyone knew that my mom, she like had flowers, right? So they would always ask me to bring flowers. What else did we do? There were dancing um, classes you would take and then my dad was always in that because my dad likes to cha-cha. That's a cool dance. Everyone got to learn how to cha-cha by the time they're like 12. And he would always try to pick me first to like help teach. I was a shy child, so it was embarrassing. <laughs> But I remember cultural days, they were so much fun and I would always have to join the like school group that did um, cultural dances. So the stuff with the like the coconut husk, not coconut husk, the shells and then like the stick dance. My mom was a teacher so she always stayed after school and so we can just join activities because mom's gonna stay at school, what else are we gonna do? besides like run around and play in the playground when everyone goes home. But yeah, just so you guys know, we do have a holiday, but it's not called Columbus Day. I just thought it was interesting. I wonder if other territories call it Columbus Day too. So we just celebrate our culture and all the cultures that we have on our island. I feel like I should just go to the store to just buy nothing because I'm just so dolled up, you know? Mm. <laughs> check me out. I hope you guys enjoyed being here with me. Again, a full list of products will be listed down below. You can also check me out on Instagram. There I post a photo of all my makeup looks along with all the products in the caption. Till the next video, I hope you all are doing well, taking great care of yourselves. I will see you all next time. Bye guys!